Buckle in, ladies and gentlemen. We got a lot of highlights incoming. Our best game of the night, though, was between two girls basketball teams. Phillips, the leaders in the Merrillwood Conference, hosting Leona Wabino, who's only a half game behind in the Northern Lakes Conference. Jada Egerbeck and her coach slash dad, Mike, talking it out. This was a good game halfway through the first. Rebels are going to work it inside and then back out for a Riley Yeager. Somehow bank three. Leona Wabino only down two. But this is when the loggers would start to roll away with it. This pass is going to trickle out to Egerbeck, and she nails the jumper. She finished with 32 points on the night. Later, it's Aaron Rodgers, I mean, Egebrecht finding uh, Casey Egebrecht, who finishes it off the glass. Their lead grows to six. And then some great ball movement is going to lead to a corner three for this girl right here, Jensen Week. Loggers were up 17 at halftime. They'd beat the Rebels by 18. Switching to the boys, Crandon on the road taking on Prentice. We're going to go to the very first play of this ball game, and it's some grant, great anticipation from Alex Shanter. Steals the ball and then is going to lay it in for two. A great start for the Buccaneers. The Cardinals, though, would come out shooting. Jackson Keepers, no hesitation. Three-pointer is nothing but net. He did a couple of those in the first half. But now check out the big move from the big man. Spin move, layup, and the foul. Ashton Makovsky showing off. And then later, it's kick it out. And then to Reese, who drills the three-pointer. Prentice holds off the Cardinals at home, 74-68. to Our final local game of the night, Tomahawk hosting Rib Lake. Jump into the second half of this one. We're going to see another great steal, this time from Jacob Towley. But check out the chase down block from Michael Bochart. That's a major hustle. And then he runs around me. So kind of him. But on the other side, Tyler Jablonski says, anything you can do, I can do better. A big time rejection. But that's not the only part of his game that he's showing off. The offensive board and then pulls up for three and drills it. Hatchets, though, are down 16. Uh, and it's because Rib Lake was working it inside to Jordan Yanko. Doesn't get the first time, but hey, Stadger Pats and finishes it there. Rib Lake wins on the road 52-40. to 40.